Karicho, YouTubers, this is Red Stock straight from Norfolk, Virginia. Yeah, I'm back in my little room here. This is video review for Transformers Decepticon Cyclonus, and this is the rare blue eared variant. So, hey, let's take a look at the box. I don't know if you can tell, but he's got his blue ears. Here's the front of the box, a little transformation sequence on the top. Not really difficult. Here's the side of the box, good old Cyclonus. The back of the box and yeah I actually have the tech spec reader somewhere and if you want to read his little bio you certainly can and there it is I love that little saying uh, shoot man I forget where the tech spec reader is I'll get that later not really important right now uh, side of the box and of course the bottom so let's go ahead and take good old cyclonus out and, and see this thing right here pop up his little landing gear and there we go uh, let's just go ahead and look at it from this angle a uh, neat little toy there's no doubt about it i like it uh I like i really dig his cantilevered wings i'll show you that right there he's got the little rub symbol and of course the vertical stabs over here so i just love this jet i don't know what's so it's just awesome to me i don't know why but from the bottom you can see the undercarriage stuff. It's no big deal. You can clearly see his base face even though it's got a good good good, you know <laughs> I just like it. I like the jet. Uh, I wish it could be a little bit more menacing uh, but Other than that, it, you know, it rolls around. Okay, there's the jet Let's see. Yeah, it rolls around, but you know like it's taking off or something. I don't know. That's okay. You know what? What can I say? It's a cool jet. And excuse me for my camera work, it ain't the greatest. Oh well, you know what? <laughs> That's quite all right. Well, I'm, ha I'm really having trouble with this guy, so I'll give it a seven out of 10, cause he's okay. Also, I don't know if I wanna show you this, but I had the good fortune of getting back in the day the 1986 buying guide so yeah you can actually see all the cool toys you can get yeah isn't that cool man shockwave all the cool decepticons let's face it the decepticons are the coolest even the megatron so yeah jetfire optimus blaster yeah pretty darn awesome also came with some instructions but let's face it it takes you about three seconds to transform and if you had a special order, you can actually order some cool little robots right here, like Overdrive, Camshaft. Let me see if I have that. This dude right here, Overdrive. Yeah, neat little thing. And darn it if I can't see. Oh yeah, here's the tech specs. Like, so there, <laughs> I had it, bingo. All right, enough about that nonsense. Let's go ahead and transform this bad boy, which takes all about two seconds. All right, maybe a little bit more. Flip this humongous head <laughs> nose piece down. And here's the beginning. The nose piece is actually soft rubber, which is actually the beginning of safety, I guess, safety protocols. I don't know if they're getting scared about that, but hey, it's actually soft rubber. It's not rubbery in this. I mean, it bends a little bit, but that's it. Put the nose wheel, or sorry, landing gear down into his chest, snaps on really tight, and that was difficult. And this is one thing I really hate about this, his arms just absolutely suck. <laughs> Alright, first of all, let me get his legs out of the way, so they kind of ratchet, so they ratchet down here 90 degrees, and then just flip his legs out, and they just kind of snap in like that. Same thing with the other leg, so yada, 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 nothing special. Let's move this bad boy back so you can kind of see. Now let me, and of course, you know, I don't have my traditional tripod, so I'm kind of suffering. All right, now his horrible, horrible fists, which just pretty much roll down just like that. And all you have to do is rotate it 90 degrees inwards. And the wings just go back. Oh yeah, you know, I'm signed for a reason because this could have been a freaking awesome character. There is no doubt. I love this dude. I love the blue ears. Let's check out the blue ears, shall we? Yeah. I love the detail on his head. Everything is cool about that. Articulation. What can I say? Not the, uh, not the hottest, the, not the hottest dude in the, in, well, you can say, I guess in G1. I mean, he does have a swivel joint on his elbow, 
I guess you can tell that elbow does have a single joint right there and his fists are molded in which completely suck he does have a gun which i have no idea what i do with this bad boy oh yeah it's right here so you can put a little gun over here so yeah there we go pretty menacing no waist articulation no head articulation knees <laughs> buckled over the wrong way it could be double jointed i guess but really yeah right okay and this really stiff joints and then you have an ankle pivot all right yeah yeah the guy sucks but hey as a brick he's not that bad look i'll give him a six out of ten he's not horrible but he um uh, he's almost voyager voyager size here he is with deep dive so you can pretty much tell what's going on here so yeah it's not bad not bad at all so that's all i got youtubers and i'll catch you all next time